Prove the following identity. Sine theta over 1 minus cos theta is equivalent to cosec theta plus cot theta. Okay, this is going to require a special technique. Unless you've actually seen it before, you wouldn't probably wouldn't realise how, how to do this. So, we've got to prove that sine theta over 1 minus cos theta is equivalent to cosec theta plus cot theta. Okay, so we're going to start with the left-hand side. So, that's sine theta over 1 minus cos theta. And we're going to work with it until we get to the right-hand side. So writing down sine theta over 1 minus uh, cos theta, what we're going to do, because it's minus here, we're going to multiply by 1 plus cos theta. And because we've done it to the um, denominator, you have to also do it to the numerator. And this is okay, because really, technically, you're just multiplying by 1, because these will cancel out. Unless you've seen this technique before, you probably wouldn't realise to do it. So the denominator now is of this type, a plus b, a minus b, a plus b times a minus b, and we know that's equal to a squared minus b squared. So this is going to be equal to 1 squared minus cos squared theta. And then for the numerator, we're going to do sine theta times 1, which is sine theta, and then sine theta times plus cos theta, which is plus sine theta cos theta. Right, now we recognise that 1 minus cos squared theta is all, comes from like sine squared theta plus cos squared theta is equal to 1, and therefore sine squared theta is equivalent to 1 minus cos squared theta. So now replacing the denominator with sine squared theta, on the top we have sine theta plus sine theta cos theta, on the bottom we now have sine squared theta, so we've used an identity to replace this. Separating up, the, separating up the denominators, we've got sine theta over sine squared theta plus sine theta cos theta over sine squared theta. Right, obviously these now cancel, so that squared sine will cancel with that one, we get 1. And again here, that squared sine will cancel with that sine theta, and we get 1 over uh, cos theta over sine theta. Writing that out, we get 1 over sine theta plus cos theta over sine theta. Now, 1 over sine theta is equal to is equivalent to cosec theta, and that cot theta is equivalent to cos theta over sine theta. So this now we will now replace with cosec theta, plus cos theta over sine theta is cot theta. So we've got cosec theta plus cot theta, which is what we had to prove. Therefore, we have reached the right-hand side. So we, what we've done here is prove a trig identity using the idea of the difference of two squares. I hope you understood and I thank you very much for watching.